You know what, just... Oh, oh okay, okay, alright, whatever. I'm fine, I'm fine. I was gonna set off that arrow trap with this rock, just because I could, but it turns out that I... Apparently uh, decided to jump down here instead. Not, I just don't feel like I'm in a good position to be trading rope for money right now. That's why I did not uh, drop a rope in order to go get that jewel. Oh. Alright, I'm just gonna outrun this spider. No, I'm not. I'm gonna kill this spider. I made a bad choice. I should have outrun that spider. See a crate. Crates are awesome. I am more excited about crates in this game than I'm with treasure chests, in fact. Uh, uh, Alright. I'm still getting used to, like, both the bomb drop when you do this, like, where it drops, and how far the bomb explodes, but I think that that's gonna be good at open. No, no, I'm dumb because it will also blow up the, uh, the spot I was planning on standing on. Okay, whatever. Bomb and a rope. In for a bomb, in for a bomb, and a rope. Damn. That was just a poorly timed whip on my part. Alright. Well, I got two bombs. Alright. So I traded a rope for five bombs, is basically what I just did there. Um, and now I've got a lot, a lot of bombs, so I might as well drop one right here and try and climb across to get to the damsel. And of course that won't quite work the way that I want it to. Huzzah! Okay. Ghost says, no looking around. It's time for you to leave, son. I might switch to the dog, damsel. Yeah, that's right. Double kill. I like to try things that I know that there's a pretty good chance that I'll fail at, like throwing that pot at that spider. At least when there's, you know, very little penalty for failure. Just because that way I learn how to do those things over time. This seems really dangerous for this damsel. Like, why did she get over by those spikes? I can, I'm gonna drop her into this pit. Should've gotten snaked. Twice there. Twice there I should've gotten snaked. I deserved to get snaked. I do see a shop down there. And I am excited about that. You know, who built all these ladders? Like, all these ladders make me feel like, you know, I'm just somewhere that people have explored before. Bring the damsel with me. Down to the shop. Spring shoes. Climbing gloves and a pitcher's mitt. What do climbing gloves do? They sound really good. Even the most slippery of walls can now be clung to. Oh my god, those are good! Holy cow! Now I'm curious. I guess I can afford all of these things. 
Can I actually equip all of these things? I can jump higher. Oh yeah. You know what? Yeah, we're just gonna we're just gonna grab all the things. Pitcher's mitt improves my throwing and catching skills. Both. Um, alright, I'm sorry to do this to you, damsel, but uh you'll live. Oh god, will I? Oh no, I'm not holding her. Ah! Ah! Damsel! Damsel! Dude! No! Not the not the brat! No! 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 Ah, ah, ah. Alright, I got a little unnecessarily dicey at the end there, but, you know, it wasn't so bad. I don't have any money left over, but... We're cool, we're cool. I mean, I'm also, you know, I can, like, climb anything now, which is pretty nice. And I can jump out right- Oh! Okay, whatever. I think that the arrow trap actually does do two damage, so... What I want is to aggro the spider into the arrow trap, which then didn't go off. Oh man, that was such a good set of equipment at the uh, at the shop. Oh, that's that's the big bad spider. That spider's not messing around, man. I'm just not gonna like he is just not worth dealing with for just a just a pile of gold. Uh uh. Do not want. The real danger here is that like I'm not used to the uh, the spring shoes at all. Oh. Oh god, I got lucky there. That could have been death on the spike trap for sure. I don't even know why I wanted to kill him so much, in all honesty. Just hatred of spiders. The, uh, yeah. I almost feel like the equipment that I got at that, uh, that item shop is, like, cheating. I also have an absurd amount of bombs. Which, you know what, actually, can I use one of those to kill him? Is that going to be a good idea? Probably not a good idea. It's an idea, but, you know, good. It's something different entirely, but I'm going to do it anyways. Oh! Jeez. I'm just, like, getting hit by bats for no good reason. right here. Oh, this is really bad news right here. Oh, jeez. Oh, alright. He doesn't like it when you drop bombs in his shop, it turns out. That's, that's a fact, actually. He's not a big fan of you blowing up his livelihood. Man, he's crazy fast, and he has a shotgun. It's not great. Not great at all. Alright, I'm gonna give this one more try, I think. Oh, first, first though. First, I'm gonna change my damsel to the dog, because frankly, why wouldn't you be rice cooing a dog, you know? I mean, we got, we got our share of boobies, you know, that's one thing. You can also have a man, you know, all dressed up. But I'm gonna go with the dog, the derpy dog. That's how I roll. Actually, I wonder if for some reason, I assumed that this was going to be, like, all three of them. But I guess that's probably just, like, random. Doesn't seem too bad. Whatever, I'm rescuing the dog, though. Adventure! Always choose the girl. I don't know. It's just how I roll.
I would really like to unlock more characters. I don't know why. The characters have no effect on the gameplay. At all. But, uh, still. I would, I would like to have more characters. By the way, the uh, name of the symbol with the snake eating its own tail is an Uroboros. If you did not know. Now you do. These are the random facts that I have picked up throughout the course of my life. That's right, Snake, you can't kill me. Because I threw your pot. I did not break it from point blank range. Alright, what exactly is beneath me right now? Cool. Oh, I just saw Dewey start playing Team Fortress 2. I might join him, actually. Because, you know, why not? I've already declared that this will be my last, uh... Last run at Spelunky. Oh god, alright. Can I clear that jump? I can! Cool, cool. And I can get a damsel. your bombs with this and they'll stick to pretty much anything. Sticky bombs. Alright, I'm sorry puppy, but I have to do this. This is the only way to rescue you. It'll it'll hurt you more than it hurts me. In fact, that's the whole point. Um. Well, I guess I'm just gonna get out of here. I don't really see any, any low-hanging fruit. Or low-hanging loot, as it were. And we're at five hearts. Five hearts. That's right, game. Five hearts and seven bombs. Still got my four ropes around. Probably gonna die to something stupid like a spike trap. Oh, yes. spiders. There's a lot of reasons why I hate the giant spiders. You know what? It was it was worth the damage. Not too damage, though. It was not worth too damage. At all. Uh, bomb box? What does a bomb box do? It's probably like 10 bombs. What's the rate of exchange line up on that? Bomb bag is 3 at 2500. This must be like really a lot of bombs. I wish I had enough money for the climbing gloves. I really do. In fact, I'm just thinking about just cashing in bombs for them. Got a parachute. By cashing in bombs, I mean like uh, just blowing up dirt until uh, until I can afford them. Which, you know what, since I hate these spiders so much... Oh right, I've got sticky bombs. That worked well though. That really did work well. I'm double pasty now. Yeah, alright. Climbing gloves, sweet. I'm sold. Oh, oh jeez. Ah. Oh. No, oh, oh, that's cruel, game. That's cruel. Oh. oh, geez. Come with me if you. Oh, no, no. I'm sorry, dog. I'm sorry. Ah. 
I think the dog's dead. I think I killed the dog. He doesn't have like the little stunned thing around him. Yeah, no. I killed the dog. I'm a monster. <laughs> he got He got shot point blank by that uh that arrow trap. He's dead. A scorpion! Ugh. Ugh. Dang it. I haven't fought enough scorpions to really know exactly how to deal with them. Like, in terms of the single player, I've literally, like... I think you guys have now watched half of the single player that I've ever played. If you have watched these episodes. But sometimes I can do awesome stuff like that. I'm really not a fan of this setup. Because if that giant spider comes out, bad, bad things are gonna happen. Oh! N oh. Whew! Thank you, Parachute. I forgot I had you, in all honesty. I got a lot of bombs. I don't have a lot of rope, but it doesn't actually matter, because... I've got the climbing gloves, so... Dang. Oh, spidered. Got spidered so hard. All right, well, that'll do it. You, uh, I hope you guys have a good feel for Spelunky. The multiplayer is actually a freaking blast, though, so I, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna, like, do one round or two rounds. Yeah, I'll do a couple rounds against bots here, just so you guys can see that, round off this episode a bit. Um, it's not online. Um, by multiplayer, I mean deathmatch. It's not online, but if you've got three friends and you're sitting around an Xbox, you got four controllers, you know what? This is a freaking blast. I can vouch for it 100%. So I'm just going to play against bots here. Always, always, always choose the girl. But I always, always, always press left instead of right there. I figure the girl's to the left. I should just hit left to get to the girl. But no, you've got to hit right because you're controlling the character in the direction that they walk. So the default is actually to start with four bombs. I start with two bombs, because otherwise it's quite chaotic. Oh. The whip doesn't deal damage in this, it just stuns. Um, and the shotgun is absurdly powerful, though he does at least have a shield. But he dropped it. Threw it at me, actually. Yay, victory! And the ghosts can blow on you. They can try and knock you off the edge and kill you. And if everyone dies really close to the same time, um, or the last two people die, or whatever, really close to the same time, then, um... You, uh, actually don't, like, no points are awarded for that round. So if you're a ghost, that's, like, what you want. I don't know where my bomb just went. Oh, jeez. Okay, alright, alright. I'm real low here. Oh, no, no. Oh, no! Dang it! That blue son of a bitch. Chops. I call him the Scott. <laughs> oh jeez, alright. I've never actually played on these jungle levels before. They're crazy dangerous though. I want this kit here. Alright, cool. Um, the jetpack's pretty good. So the jetpack you can uh... Once this jerk stops blowing on me, there we go. All right, the other guy just kind of ended up murdering himself on the on the terrain, which is not great behavior for a bot, but it's also something that human beings do pretty often. So, oh, I just got what I call the murder weapon. So it replaces your whip, and it just kills people. Instead of, like, stunning them, you just kill them in one hit. It's outrageously powerful. So that's how you crush bots? What bots? You ghosts now! I hope you guys enjoyed Spelunky. I'm just gonna steal Zach's line. Keep gaming. <laughs>